What up, what up, what up? What's going on, YouTube? And we're back with another video. And today, we are going to lay down some paint. Today, we are going to paint the Crown V, you know? Uh, regardless of how it turns out, I've been waiting too long. I've been, you know, from the rain to the work schedule to everything like that. Today, we are going to lay down some paint. And, uh... I went back, got a few things, uh, uh, switched up the gun. So now I got this, the Spectrum. Uh, they say that it's a pretty good gun. I don't know because I'm not familiar with this paint thing. So, you know, we're gonna go through the process and check it out and see what's going on. See how the paint lays and everything like that. Um, I'm a little, I'm pretty, uh, I'm pretty comfortable with, with mixing the paint. The <laughs> only thing about this is spraying the paint. That's the only thing about it. So, you know, just stay tuned and let's see what's going on. All right. Yeah, so, you know, we got the Spectrum. Let's check. Now we about to open this, check it out, see what's going on with it. Uh... You know, I still got my Brillo pad that I will be uh, sanding, uh, just going over the car in certain spots. I already done went over the car, but I'm just going to go over the car again. Then I'm going to tack the whole car, and then we're going to paint. So, with the Spectrum gun. Uh, it come with the, um, it come with the adapter, so you can put the, uh, the cup on. I got some cups. Let me show y'all these two. I just went and grabbed, just went and grabbed some cups. Uh, just grab, just grab some, just in case, you know, I might need, I might not use them all, but I have them around because I am going to be painting uh, Buford, which is my 98 Ford F-150. I will, I am going to be painting that one. I'm going to rebuild in that truck. So I'm just trying to be prepared for everything, y'all. Uh, another thing, I went back, I went and bought me two more guns, got them all set up. Uh, 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 got me a paint stain, you know I got my, let me see if y'all can see this. You know I got my, uh, I got my mask, got my, uh, my paint gun stain, and... I got a clear, I got a whole gallon of uh, a paint. So, y'all know what's going on. Here we is, we about to finish opening this package. You got the adapter that come with the Spectrum. Um, let's see. You got a little, you got the kit. You know, you got your little, you got your tool. You got your brush, you got your filter. You got some instructions. And then you have the paint gun. Um, it don't seem as big as the other guns that you would get from Harbor Freight. As you can see, it's all shiny and all of that. It's small, so I, I kind of like this right here. Those other guns, these guns right here, they're heavy and they kind of big. So we're going to check that out, see what's going on. You got it for the the fan. You got it for the for the. Uh, I'm guessing this is the uh, the fluid. Then you got the air pressure right here. So uh, now we just got to set everything up. I already got. I already got this together. Put my little filter on there. Put all of that on there. So you know. Now we just about to put it together. Yeah, just about to put it together now. All right, so give me a minute. All right, so I don't know if you can see this. Let me see if you can see this good. Oh, nah. uh, let me set this right. Okay, so what? Now I got my gun, and I got the pressure gauge, and I got the water and oil separator. So you want your lines to go up, and the only thing I'm gonna do is just take it, 
screw it in there like that. I put the tape on there so we won't uh so I won't too much have to worry about it. Alright. So now that we got that tight. Now what we're gonna do is we're gonna put on the adapter. And the adapter piece is 57505, which is this. So uh take this and put it on them. I think I might need to tape it. I'ma just tape it anyway, so I just won't have to worry about no um so I just won't have to worry about any um any oil leaking out or I mean not oil, any paint or anything like that leaking out of. So it's just always best to try to tape it. Don't put the tape uh initially over the hole because you don't want like as the tape break down it could go inside of the gun which could cause the gun to clog up so so you know all right try to make it look neat all right So we got that. Now the only thing I do is screw it on there. Just like that. Um let me see if this one of these gun if one of these uh pieces are tightened. Go ahead and tighten it all the way down. Alright. Tighten it. Ah. And that's the way it's gonna look, just like that. So now we got the pressure. We got the water, uh, water and oil separator. Got my adapter on. Now the next thing is to try to put together the cups and stuff like that. Sand the car and then we're gonna start painting. So give me a minute. Woo! So now that we done went through and uh went over it with the uh with the Brillo pad. I don't know if y'all can see all of this. Well, let me see if you see that we don't went over the whole thing with the brillo pad now just gotta blow it off if you can see right there let me let you see right there a lot of that so that we done went through and sanded it all the way down now Woo. now i just gotta spray it off well, I'm gonna blow it off and then I'm gonna go back and I'm gonna clean it and then it will be time to be time to paint this thing. So give me, so y'all give me a minute, y'all. Yeah? All right. All right. So what we about to do now is uh, we just get ready to wipe it off. So uh, I'm gonna put you on the chest and then we're gonna start wiping the car off and everything. All right. Uh, so what we're gonna do is coming through trying to spray it out first. I don't know if you can see all of that. Trying to spray it away from the car. All we're trying to do right now just spray as much of this stuff off of it. Try to spray as much off the car as we can. So then we could just go back. Thank <laughs> you. 
I got a little bit more sanding to do right here. I don't know if you can see that. Yeah, right there. Got a little bit more sanding to do right there. But uh, we just making sure that we spray as much off of the car as we can. If we don't, everything that we don't spray off, it will be in the paint. So that's why I'm trying to make sure that I spray everything off. You can still see all of that, but a lot of the, a lot of that dust is still coming off of the car. So, just gotta make sure that we get it all off, so that we can, uh, so that it won't be in the paint. Make sure we ain't got no bugs or anything like that on the car. Neither. So now that we don't went around the whole car, let me get up here on the on the roof. Then the next thing it'll be to do is just to get up here and just wipe it down with this uh with this prep stuff. And then we will be ready to paint. Try to blow out a crack shot real good. Trying to blow everything off that I know might hold, that I know might hold dust. So, here we go. And just like that, we done spraying it off. So now the only thing we gotta do now, about to go back and wipe it all down. All right. All right, so what we're using now is this Dupla color. You can see this right here. This is the Motive Purpose uh, Foam and Prep Cleaner. So uh, I said it dry fast, fast drying formula. No residue. So uh we're just gonna spray this on the car, then we're gonna just go back and wipe it off. So let me shake it up. Put this on there, and then we're gonna wipe it all down, y'all. Alright, so give me a minute. Let me finish shaking it and then we'll get into it. Alright, so now we just get ready to spray this on. Uh-oh. Wait a minute. About to spray this on. Uh, like that. And then we're just going to go back and just wipe it off. Like this. Then I'm gonna just have to go back and hit it with a tech ray. Right. 
All right. So now that we kind of got the concept of that, let me see. I'm gonna just go ahead and do this, do this fender right here too. It seems like it drives real fast. It drives real fast. If you did, all of this right here is what would be in your paint. So make sure you get that out. All right. So now that we just got finished spraying the whole car down with this. Now, the only thing we about to do now is we gonna use the tech rag to wipe it all the way down. And then we will, um, then we'll be ready to paint. So y'all just give me a minute. If you see, we got this young lady right here. She seems like she want to be on the camera today. Say hey, Remy. Say hey, Remy. <laughs> so uh, let me get finished with that, and then we'll cut you back on. All right. Yeah, I know it's going to be another process, so um, just give me a minute, y'all. And uh, stay tuned to the next video, and we're going to lay the paint down. Just trying to make sure that I go back. I just got a little bit more, uh, got a little bit more cleaning to do. I just want to make sure that I got it clean so that the paint will actually stick to the car. So I got to get that done, y'all. So uh, let me get that done. All right. 